Hello, people. So today I want to dive into attracting that soulmate. And I know a lot of us see it on social media a lot and, oh, you have to love yourself and you have to work on yourself. But I am telling you right now from personal experience that it is so true. So today I want to discuss the law of attraction in relationships and dating and how it has helped me so much to discover who I am in order to discover what I want, right? And who I want. So the first number one rule in finding that person that you are trying to attract into your life is being that person that you are trying to attract, right? You must make a list of this. These are the qualities that I'm looking for in a partner. And also analyzing yourself and thinking, okay, but do I have those qualities myself? And if you don't, then you need to step it up and do some work on yourself, right? Or you need to change what you are seeking and the characteristics that you're looking for in someone else. So it all begins with self-love. Uh, during my healing journey, I have really worked hard on myself and I am speaking to the young and the old. You don't have to be, you know, older and divorced like me in order to discover that, hey, I know exactly what I'm looking for and what I want, and I am going to find it, but I need to love me first and be that person first, right? So it all begins with self-love. It all begins with loving that person that you wake up with, that you go to bed with, that you look at in the mirror daily. It all begins with really looking deep into your eyes and saying, I do love you and believing it, believing it. So I have written affirmations on my mirror that I look at daily and I do tell myself daily. And I'm going to challenge all of you to do this. Uh, on your mirror, I want you to write that you love yourself. I want you to write three characteristics that you want in someone else that you have in yourself. And I want you to tell yourself that daily. I want you to look at yourself and say, I am successful. I am loving. I do love me. I do enjoy my own company. And you will start to see that you will attract these people that are seeking the same thing and are the same thing and have the same thing to offer. Now, it can be a little bit difficult. It feels silly at first, right? I remember the first time that I looked in the mirror and said that I love myself. It was the most emotion I have felt in so long and probably ever will because it was this flood of uh, ignorance that was leaving. It was this flood of abandonment. It was this flood of feeling like so much joy finally and acceptance for myself that I had never felt before. And it is a truly amazing feeling. So in order to find that soulmate that you are seeking and begin with the law of attraction, right? We Whatever we throw out there comes back to us. It starts with self-love. So for today, I am going to challenge you all to start your self-love journey by writing your affirmations on the mirror, by writing your affirmations on a piece of paper, paper and putting it under your pillow. Start today. Start finding that soulmate that you are seeking by finding that person in you, by seeking yourself first, by seeking love within you first. Thank you and have a glorious day.